hello students welcome to analog circuits laboratory myself v naresh labastain department of ece following are the list of experiments eighth experiment is parameters of operational amplifiers first one is input offset voltage second is common mode rejection ratio means cmr r we are discussing the input offset voltage okay na this is vos here this is the vos input offset voltage and this is the circuit diagram for input offset voltage and here the both input terminals are given to and here this is the inverting terminal is zero potential and the non inverting terminal is also zero potential and you observe the v out value and that v out equal to minus rf by ri into v in you already know that rf value is 100 kilo ohms and ri value is 100 ohms and uh, find and observe the v out value and uh, and for example here v in is the v in v in is the input offset voltage you already know that uh, v out value and rf value ri value and calculate the v vos value and here the both inputs are try to ground the both differential and common mode signals are zero and this is ad or ac the both signals are zero the output should be to be zero zero in practice however mismatch in amplifier components result in measurable output voltage vo the input offset voltage vos is the differential input required to make the output zero and is typically 1 millivolts and typically millivolts and for example and with the we observe the v in output or offset voltage in millivolts okay na for example that millivolts to should be to rounded to zero means you have to connect the some potentiometer to to first pin to fifth in middle of the first pin to Fifty pin. Okay, you can vary the potentiometer in negative DC voltage. You can observe the up to V out should be to zero volts. Okay, na. And in go to practically, and the same circuit is connected upon the breadboard. And here the input terminals are inverting terminal, non-inverting both are in zero potential. Okay, na. This is the this is the non-inverting terminal and this is the inverting terminal and next go to the switch on the power supply and this is the three point four two is the V out value and here the V out equal to three point four five you already know the R F equal to hundred kilo ohms and R I equal to hundred ohms. These three values are substituted to here and observe the offset voltage V O S. And uh, here V O T is three point four five into hundred divided by hundred into ten to the power of three. Hundred hundred is cancelled. And V O S equal to three point four five into ten to power of minus three means V input offset voltage is three point four five milli volts. Okay, na this is the input offset voltage. Discussing the common mode rejection ratio that is C M R R. In C M R R, two modes are there that is differential mode and common mode. And this is circuit diagram for a differential mode. And here inputs are V one and V two. Okay, na. Next, this is the V D is the differential mode output, and here you can take the V one is five volts and V T is three volts. The V D equal to four point four five, and the for formula equal to V D equal to A D into V D. A here A D is the differential mode gain. A D equal to V D by V in, and you already know that V D is the differential output voltage is four point four five. Here V in equal to V one minus V two. V one is five volts and V two is three volts. That is five minus three, two volts. Okay, na? 
the AD gain equal to 4.45 by 2 that is 2.225 this is the differential mode gain next go to the common mode here this is the circuit diagram for common mode here small changes are the both inputs are in same input voltage that is common input that is VCM here VCM equal to 5 volts and uh, the V0 is the output voltage is 0 0.04 and the V0 equal to AC into VC AC is the common mode gain the AC equal to V0 by VC V0 is the output voltage and VC is the common input that is 5 volts ok na? 0 0.04 by 5 equal to 0 0.008 and the CMRR common mode rejection ratio equal to AD by AC this is the AD value and this is the AC value Do these two AD and AC values substitute in CMRR formula and you can get the CMRR value that is 278.12 in CMRR in decibels that is 20 log of AD by AC equal to 48.88 ok na? this is the common mode rejection ratio the same circuit is connected upon the breadboard and here the V1 and V2 is taken from the dual regulator power supply and the VCC and VWE is given from the fixed power supply. The output is observed through multimeter and next go to the switch on the power supply. First go to the given input is that V1 is the 5 volts and V2 is 3 volts and next to switch on the fixed power supply that is plus VCC and minus VCC that is VCC and VWE and next to go to the switch on the multimeter ok na? here V1 is 5 volts here the V1 is 5 volts input and V2 is 3 volts and substitute to given to input in differential mode the output is 4.4 ok na? 4.4 and next VD equal to AD into V in the AD equal to VD by V VD is the 4.45 and the V in is 5 minus 3 2 volts and substitute to here the differential mode gain AD equal to 2.225 ok next to go to the common mode in this common mode remove the one input the only one input is the common that is 5 volts and remove the 3 volts and the width is 3 volt this is the 3 volt remove it and Okay, na? and this is the this is the output that is V naught zero point zero four. VCM is five volts, and here the VCM is five volts, and uh, V naught is zero point zero four, and here the formula is V naught equal to AC into VC. Here AC equal to V naught by VC. V naught is zero point zero four. VC is the common input that is five volts. 0 0.05 5 volts that is 0 0.008 the CMRR equal to AD by AC and here 2.2225 0 0.008 equal to 278.12 the CMRR in D, DB that is 20 log of AD by AC here that is 48.88 in decibels ok now this is the common mode rejection ratio using differential mode and common mode Okay, thank you.